scram that coffee machine. All the engineers are busy just making coffee. Working in an Italian team is mandatory. You have to have an espresso machine. Am I wrong, Carlo? No, no, no. Yeah. no. Yeah. The first thing to be up and the last to This is, this is the really track. the key that Prema is the winning team. It's all about the coffee machine. Number five. Being comfortable with the mechanics is extremely important. You know, at the end of the day, they're the ones that uh, are preparing the car. And you know, if a, if a screw's loose or if something's wrong, um, it can it can be a big problem on track when you're driving at very high speeds. So uh, yeah, I trust them um, with everything I have. I, I you know, I've had a big crash this year. I crashed in Monza very heavily, and they're. They're, they're so great, they stayed up all, all night, they fixed the car and I ended up even racing in the morning when we didn't think it was possible, so I really couldn't do it without them and uh, yeah, a big, big thank you and uh, I have all my trust in them. Relationships with uh, my teammates I think are, are relatively good considering that we're, you know, we're, we're competitors, we all want to win. We, we have great friendship off the track, um, you know, there's always, of course, the, the competition side, but we respect each other. There's some difference in age, you know, Felix is the oldest, so he's mature, he kind of, he's seen it before and stuff, so it's cool having someone like that around that's, you know, not just, uh, he doesn't just want to kill you all the time or whatever you want to call it, he's, he's very, you know, he's relaxed, he, he's calmer, so it's cool having someone like him and he's a super nice guy, Jake as well is a great guy. Um, you know, we all have fun together. When we're getting changed in the truck here, we all have good jokes and just a good, a good group of guys. And it's rare to have that. So um, no, I'm having a I'm having a fun year, not just on the track, but as well off the track with the teammates. Uh, we've got a good, uh, good team this year. Action! So. Over here is uh, the legendary driver coach. I don't like that. You know? Okay, keep going. He's uh, <laughs> he's uh, he's uh, always giving some good tips. Only a few bad tips, but uh, mostly he's uh, he's correct. So and breaking very a bit and breaking my balls, of course. How could I forget? And you can put Pete. So he's a very important member of the team. You know. And then over here we have Esteban, which is just another guy to pass through Prima. No big deal. <laughs> no, no. He's uh, last year's champion. So. He came in rookie year and uh, won it, so respect. And then we have Danny over here, uh, another champion. So I'm saying all these champions, I guess I'm the only one that's not. You need to I show something. I need to show four champions. Yeah. Uh, oh, a yeah. good group of guys. <laughs> yeah, they have these little chats in the end of the day when everything goes well. Yeah. They are much more relaxed and fun like today. But even in the bad moments, it's always nice to always. see the old, yeah. old guys here. But it's never nice to see. Yeah, no, you were a bit of pain in the ass, but okay, we need to live with it for a couple more races. <laughs> <laughs> ah, you don't do it to finish now. <laughs> I'm not a pro. Stop pretending! <laughs> my family is, is a huge part of my career. My father is heavily involved, obviously, from a financial point of view, from everything. He started off with me at a young age, he's been at all the races. but. We have a very good relationship in the sense that he'll know when it's time that I work with the team. You know, at the end of the day, he's just a father like any other father in the paddock. Maybe it's a bigger name, whatever it is, but he's here watching his son race like anyone else, and I think that's that's the main thing. And you know, he'll he'll let me do my thing. He lets me work with the team. He doesn't get in the way. You know, he loves me like any other father loves his son, and he comes and watches me race every weekend. Having him around is fantastic. Even my mother, having her around, coming to all the races. Um, it's a great thing. Uh, my sister unfortunately lives in Boston studying over there so I'm sure if she, if she was living nearby she would attend them as well but I think it's a bit too long of a flight to make it all the time but um, no it's it's extremely important I, you know as well having Hugo having having an entourage my best friend comes very often and I think it makes a huge difference you know I, I think I have a great uh, great team around me and, yeah, and I'm very thankful for it. Uh, I don't have too many superstitions, just a couple. Um, I mean, uh, obviously I, on Sunday I put the same underwear uh, all the time. Uh, just little things that you, you start when you're in go-karts and you don't really, you know, you don't want to want to change them or, or, because you know, you never know, it can maybe be something that, um, that affects your performance, but 
at the end of the day, you know, I don't think, I don't believe in that stuff too much. I just believe in doing the work properly and uh, preparing as well as possible. I think that's what makes the real differences. The funniest moment with the team, whenever I'm around Renee, <laughs> things seem to uh, to calm down a bit. No, um, it's no, no specific moment. I mean, we just, we work very well together. We're, we, we had great success last year in Formula 4 winning the championship. And, um, you know, I think we're having great success again this year in Formula 3 and, you know, we're fighting for the championship every year and it's just a fantastic group of people we have at Prema and um, I'm truly honoured to, to be part of uh, such a great team. Now it's the end of the weekend. I really hope you enjoyed watching this video. Uh, it's time for me to go, so bye-bye. Uh,